Welcome back, pilots. I actually opened the mic up this time to see what talking does. Eh. I'll talk or I won't. We'll see what happens. I tend to cover up the microphone with my finger sometimes, so you may not always be able to hear me. <coughs> and I have something in my throat, so I may cough a bunch. And I have some music playing in the background that's basically old middies from the 90s, because I like having music, but you get tagged too much for having somebody else's crap. So I took somebody recorded some songs. I'm not going to tell you who it is, see who can guess first. But they're all by the same band, but they're old MIDI music from the 90s. Anyway, that's that. If we get to a commercial, I've recorded two more. So a quick, quick stroll through my uh, hangar here. I've finally gotten my guys to where I want them, roughly. I'm going to take the robots up to level 9. I'm trying to stay in Pond 3. I don't want to enter the shark tank because it's insane. It's hard to play there. Way too much way too much adrenaline involved in that it wears me out too fast. I'll stay in Pond 3 as long as possible. So it, uh, all my weapons that I'm using are at level 11 and all my robots are, are at level 7 now. I'm gonna go ahead and run them up to maybe 9. We're, we're playing with that idea. Um, for the longest time I didn't upgrade anything. I just stacked silver and gold and bought pilots and drones and stuff like that. Uh, let's go back and look at the hangar because I've accumulated a few robots since then. As you can see, I've got two Yamabushis and three Vikings. Uh, the first Viking I bought for $20. You can see the video of that back in the day. Uh, as it is, we're coming up on one year anniversary of this channel. I started doing videos almost a year ago, so there's that. I hadn't done one in a while. figured it was time to take a look at what I got going on here. Um, these all just have the, the silver modules because modules cost a lot and I got other crap I want. But all the weapons are level 11. And I got names for all these guys because, oops, not what I wanted to do. Hit the wrong button there. Let's put that back. So I'm calling this one Thor. <laughs> because Thor's got a hammer, and that word right there means hammer in Arabic or something. The Hummer was actually supposed to be called the Hammer, but they called it the Hummer for some reason. Language differences, I guess. I do not know. Do you know who the band is yet? Have you pegged the music? This is a pretty obvious song here. And this is my most recent edition. So I bought two of these Vikings and one of the Bushies, and then the other Bushy and Viking I built out of the workshop. Um, this one just got its drone yesterday, so it's up and running. Uh, the bison, this is my my default drop bot on the small maps. Go for the center flag, take out two or three robots in the process. I usually get two at the minimum. Uh, sometimes I don't take any out, it's pretty rare. This thing demolishes just about anything with one, one round out of those weapons. Takes out almost any bot. Anyway, let's see what else we got. This is technically the bison is actually one light weapon more powerful than any of the other bots you see here. So let's go through here real quick. Start off at the beginning, get through all these. They line these up different than they used to before the update. They changed this all around. This is another favorite. I really like this robot, just because I like the jumpers probably. And this one does some serious damage. I'm not gonna upgrade these anymore. Um, I don't like the transformers. They, they take another level of concentration I just don't seem to possess. Maybe I'm too old. Um, that's a damage dealing bot. If you know how to drive these things, you can be devastating. I just do not know how to do it. So I don't enjoy playing them, so I don't. The Hoplite is a damage master. Um, it's technically the same power as the Bison, really. It's um, one light weapon heavier than a Viking. <laughs> oh, one heavy, one light. Yeah. Same. It's the same as the bison. So technically, the bison is as powerful as this offensively. It's just not nearly as tough. That thing, this thing can take a beating. This one I try and use. I, I reserve it for uh, samurais that I can land near. Um, the weapons are aren't up to what level they should be. I don't really care. It's not my weapon of choice. Um, I just put level one hounds on this as a sort of a place marker. Um, I don't have anything on any of those. The Paladin's a great robot. Uh, if you want to put a cover in the mic there. Paladin's a great robot. It can do a lot of damage. I missed this robot. Those are just placeholders, too. Uh, I thought about putting some 550 weapons on here, because I think I got the max sights. Yeah, 
and I could actually, I think I bought both of them for this one. So yeah, the ramrod's free. I've already paid for it. So I could go either way with that. But 550 on there, I don't know what that equates to, but it's like 720 something maybe. So you can reach out and five lights. The uh, two heavy and a light. Yeah, it's one light. One light less than a Viking. Now one of these days I'm going to do a web page. Maybe I'll put all that on there. But basically two light weapons equals one heavy weapon. Uh, two light weapons does just a hair more damage than, than one heavy, but that's so close it's equatable. Uh, someday I get a, a drone for this and I may start playing with it, but as it is, I could put the torches on it. And uh, it's only level five. I have a rough time upgrading robots that I don't really play much because it adds to my power. And I really don't want to go into the shark tank. I'm a chicken. That's why my name is Robot Chicken. Anyway. We're doing pretty good though. Still got an 85% victory ratio. I get about four kills per death. Uh, tougher matches, tougher. <laughs> Sometimes I get a lot more than that. It adds up. Uh, for a while, I was keeping my kills, which is 35,190, um, just above my power. And when they recalculated the power with the update, I ended up getting about 20,000 added to my power. Somehow I went from, I don't know, it was like 30, 31, I think, when they did that. And it went up to 45 or 48 or something. It jumps around a lot. When I do upgrades, it'll go down to it's down like 44 or something. Last upgrade on a weapon I did, and then it pops back up as soon as the upgrade's done. So I don't know what it's doing there, but it's calculating things differently. And my little mantis, this robot kicks ass. Anyway, that's all of that. And I was going to throw down a match real quick, just so you can see what I do with these things. Um, I don't know, the Viking's not a great robot, but I like it. I, I like the way it plays, I like the the tactics that I use with it and whatnot, but it's not a high damage bot and it's not a um, it's not a great robot. I think it just looks menacing as hell when it's coming towards you though, don't it? <laughs> they used to my adrenaline used to kick in every time I'd see one on the battlefield back when I was a new player and I'd see somebody driving around in one and they'd always stomp me. So I got one and then I wasn't impressed with it because without a drone it's only a two heavy weapon robot which doesn't do much. Anyway, here's the map I love so much. Lag is killing me. It is deadly. And I should have taken a minute to see what was going on up here because I think there might be somebody up on the top. You get those samurais and they sit up on that top spot and you can't even you can't even target up there. It's crazy. I'm going to shut up and play for a second. If I talk too much while I play, I die. Oh, let's go the other way. Boom, up and over. Oh. Somebody was shooting hard at me. Well, let's take this in. Grab some more flags, because that's what we're supposed to do. Somebody's grabbing that center one, because I sucked. Oh, and they got killed. I need more music, that's my problem. Watch how fast these things do damage. Close the gap. The thing about shotguns is, the closer you are, the more damage they do. So it's important to be kind of close further away you are, the less damage they do. And in a one-on-one -on -one scenario, you can generally take out any robot with a Viking, if you have the right weapons on it. So unless there's more than one person shooting at me, I don't worry too much about it. The shield refro- ooh, look at that! If I hadn't seen him, I'd have jumped. But now that I saw him, I'm gonna back him up. I don't know how far away this person is. So up and over we go. Okay. I should be getting shot at by everybody behind me, but I'm not. So let's see what we can do here. Somebody's shooting at me. Who is it, though? Where's it coming from? I cannot tell. Why did I jump out of there so fast? <laughs> ah, that's who it is. Okay, well, that was, that was bold. Hmm. Getting outclassed here. I think this might have been a bad one to record, right? Maybe it's the recording that's kicking my ass being watched, even though I'm not. There we go. I got a break. That's what you call a lucky break right there. Plus, I should be in range of this guy pretty soon. Let's not screw up my... Alright, this is going to take some finesse. Notice that lag. If it wasn't for this lag, he'd be dead already. Oh, and he's smart enough to know I'm up here, but he's getting shot at from the other side like I was. 
when he was shooting at my ass. See how that karma stuff works? See, if I had my long range one, I could be kicking even more butt. I brought down the short range one. That's all right. Hey, what's going on up here? Didn't expect you to show up. Let me reload. Let me reload because you will be surprised how fast it happens once I reload. We're reloading your toast, dude. Let me jump out because I almost toast myself. Lag. Lag. Hey. Two kills. Lag. I'm dying because of lag. If it were for no lag, I'd have like won this match already. Somebody's up top shooting at my ass again. I can tell because I'm about to die. I don't want that one. Let's take this. Alright, what do we got here? I think there's somebody up there shooting at me and they're invisible or something. Yep, there he is. So you know what you do with those? You avoid them. Way over here, and you very quickly, without any hassles, sneak back, grab their flag, because they're not paying no attention to you. And then, when you're done doing that, oh, tell me where to got this one, so I should pay attention to shit like that. Did I just say a bad word? Tell me that Ronin's still back there stomping on things. Death. It's that guy. Who is that? Ace off. Who is it? Tell me who it is. Savage. I know that dude. He's almost dead, too. Sometimes it's best to just sit where you is. Start noticing how much that hurts real quick. Am I not shooting at this guy? I'm out of ammo. I should pay more attention to that instead of dashing right away. Oh, wait. Good man. Thank you. On the ball. Now, how to get to this guy as fast as possible. Switch targets in the middle of that dash. See why you don't do it right away? Say goodnight. Oh, he might survive this. Well, that was fun. Hope you could hear it all. Literally, my finger goes right over the speaker, the microphone hole. And since the lag is so bad, that's the only match I'm going to show you. I just wanted to show you the, show you the hanger more than anything, see where I was at. So, that's where it is. I had an idea where I thought I might take all my level 11 weapons. 
slap them on all my lowest robots, which if you ever watched any of my old videos, you'd realize I'll have max modules. I think I got five or six robots at the bottom with max modules. My Echo, and I don't even know what else. The Spirit, maybe. Something. Bunch of them. Anyway, I thought that might be kind of a fun thing to do, is jump into Pawn 3 with nothing but little teeny robots with max modules and badass weapons. But, I don't know. If you want to see something like that, throw a comment down below. I'm going to go watch some commercials now. Catch y'all later. Thanks for watching. Peace. Why are you not stop? I said stop. God, the lag's even affecting this. What the hell?